Part of Governor Abbott's plan to combat illegal immigration has involved busing migrants across the country to sanctuary cities. So Sanctuary Cities is a municipality that limits or denies its cooperation with the national government in enforcing immigration law. Texas has bused more than 9,700 migrants to our nation's capital since April of last year, over 7,900 migrants to New York City since August 5th, and then more than 2,300 migrants to Chicago since August 31st, and more than 1,500 migrants to Philadelphia since November of last year, and over 160 to Denver. Some have also been sent to Los Angeles. So Goliad County Sheriff Roy Boyd, who we talked to earlier this week, said he's in favor of this move to move migrants around the country. I think that the move by Governor Abbott to bus people to other, uh, you know, states such as New York was was genius because it was the one thing that finally brought to light the totality of what is going on with regards to the numbers and by governor abbott sending those people to those sanctuary locations it opened their eyes because for so long people were denying that this was taking place they can no longer deny it governor abbott has forced it upon them and now they have to deal with it the same as we do Operation Lone Star's website says that it fills the gaps left by the Biden administration's refusal to secure the border and that every individual who is apprehended or arrested and every ounce of drugs seized would have otherwise made their way into communities across Texas and the nation due to open border policies. Here's your viewer poll tonight. Do you agree with Governor Abbott's move to bus migrants across the country? Looks like 74% say yes, you're in favor of that move, busing migrants to sanctuary cities, and 27% say no, you disagree with that move. Well, thank you all for voting, and as always, come to CrossroadsToday.com slash vote to participate.